What's going on you guys? Welcome to the Single Guy channel. My name's Lloyd. Uh, so lately in my programs, I've been going over a lot of guys' uh, dating profiles and helping them out with the online dating stuff. So in this video, I thought I'd kind of talk a little bit about the three mistakes that I see most commonly happen with guys uh, with online dating. Okay, so if you want more information about this, I'm actually going to be doing a free webinar this Saturday on it. Um, so I would highly recommend that you attend that if you feel like it would be useful for you. So I'm going to give you a couple sneak peeks of kind of what's going to be included in that webinar. Um, some of the stuff that I talk about with my various uh, clients. And uh, yeah, let's just get started. Okay. Thing one, I would say probably the first thing that I noticed that a, what a lot of guys do is they pick the wrong dating app. Um, first of all, all the dating apps exist because there's different niches, there's different types of women that are going to be using that dating app. Some dating apps are better for certain things, some dating apps are terrible for certain things, you know? Um, but I see generically people will usually just uh, download Tinder or maybe Bumble or something like that and they try that and they think, okay, yeah, online dating doesn't work for me because Tinder and Bumble don't work for them. Uh, Tinder and Bumble are pretty aggressive like hookup apps. Um, not hookup apps, there's definitely people dating on them, but there's way more men than there are on Tinder than there are women. I think it's like 70% men. Um, so obviously Tinder might not be the best place for you. If you're looking for a girlfriend, say maybe Coffee Meets Bagel or, or another dating app would be really good. I myself don't do crazy well on Tinder, so I don't use it that much. I use other apps that work better for me. Um, you know, it's not that I don't get matches off there. I get plenty of matches, but it's just not really the kinds of girls that I'm always looking for. So you should pick the app that is going to work the best for you. Okay, thing two, um, they don't respond quickly enough. Uh, I see this happen all the time with clients where they have their dating profile created, they get a match, um, and then for whatever reason, they don't message the girl back very quickly, or they try and look cool and wait a while, um, or maybe they forget about it or something like that, and then they you know message them later. You should message as quickly as you can. And I'm not saying like break your back to answer a message, but like the way women are on online dating is kind of like the way some men are, is they are only on it for a short amount of time. Usually the girl is on it for like, you know, two weeks or a month or something like that. If, you know, that's, that's a pretty long time for a woman to be on it. Um, and then she kind of gets burnt out and then she doesn't really use it that much anymore. Or maybe she meets a guy, sleeps with them, or doesn't it doesn't go that well, and, or whatever it is. It, usually they're on it for a short period of time and there's gonna be a bunch of other guys that are messaging her too. You know, women, even if she's like an average looking or above average looking woman, she's getting a lot of matches um, if, you know, if she's if she's swiping, so. Keep that in mind when you're messaging a girl. If there's a girl that you potentially might like, you know, make sure you get back to her within a reasonable amount of time. Otherwise, you're leaving a lot of opportunities on the table. Okay, uh, thing three, the final thing is they don't really spend a whole lot of time on their pictures. So I've seen some profiles, I've seen, not some, I've seen many, many profiles. And I would say the majority of guys, the photos they put on there are pretty terrible. So if you're a guy who's like just slopped together a few photos, maybe they have selfies or, or like the, the lighting's not good, um, don't expect to get very many matches. And don't think that, okay, well, I've tried online dating and it doesn't work for me. Because I've seen so many guys say this and I look at their profile and it's like, dude, like, are you even trying to attract a woman with this? <laughs> like, it, it, you know, boggles my mind. Um, so I understand that for a lot of guys, they don't really like taking pictures. They think it's kind of superficial. And, and so that's kind of some limiting beliefs that I have to distill. And, you know, look, I was like that too, guys. You know, I was a guy who came into this dating business pretty much wanting to people to only talk in person. Like that was one of the things that I set out to do. And what I begin to realize is that as the modern world develops, especially with this quarantine lockdown situation that we have, you know, your digital profile is gonna be a lot more important as time goes on. So I would recommend that you not neglect it. Obviously your digital profile is only one aspect of you as a person that they're gonna decide whether they like you or not, or sleep with you or date you, whatever it is. So, but having not having it there, you're missing out for the other people that do take the time to do it. And, and that's what I teach a lot of my clients a lot of times is how to take good pictures, how to make sure they're showing the best sides of themselves and attract the kind of women that they're looking for. You know, if they're looking for just a hookup, you know, or whatever, if they're looking for a girl they're going to date, the type of girl that they want to sleep with or date, those types of things are the things that I'm really thinking about when, um, you know, I'm helping them create their profiles and everything. So um, that I would say like a lot of guys should, could put a lot more work into their pictures um, and don't think, okay, well, I put these pictures on, online dating doesn't work for me. No, you know, Try those photos out. If they don't work, try some more photos. Take some more photos uh, by yourself and see what 
see what you can come up with. I mean, it's not just like you try out online dating and it doesn't work for you. Like you can get better at just the same way that you can get better at socializing and talking to women. You know, your profile can improve over time as you get better photos, you get better at expressing yourself through that medium. Yes, it is a small window, but uh, learning how to express yourself better is a skill just like anything else. And, and that's something that I'm really gonna be talking about a lot on this webinar this Saturday. So if you're interested to learn more, I would recommend that you sign up for the mailing list down below. Again, it's free and I'm gonna be picking three guys, again, three guys that are going to have the opportunity to win a $3,000 plus uh, coaching package with me. I, it's bare minimum $3,000 coaching package. So uh, if you want the chance to win that, attend the meeting. Otherwise, you're probably going to learn some great stuff too. So I'd love to see you there. Thanks a lot, you guys. Good luck out there.